final four of the regular season. All four will be on the road. The first two will be in St. Louis. Because David back is, as we mentioned, back in the lineup, and as his career winds down, he is back where it all started. To be back for the city that I started my career in, uh, a lot of memories, and and to have that final day, knowing that was, um, you know, I was going to have that opportunity after a, a season where I was out of the lineup more than I was in the lineup to be given that opportunity, just forever grateful. But that day, there was a lot of floods of emotions, of moments. You know, great and moments that were trying and, and years that were trying there. Crispy warm up. Oh, what do you say? Crispy warm up. Let's go. <laughs> oh, don't be scared to make friends. It's just really nice to have somebody you've gotten to know so well through the game to get to share a moment like this where, you know, we're deciding this is the time to leave the game. I mean, he, he meant a lot to our team as far as his leadership and, and more about kind of helping the young guys and what he's been doing off the ice. I mean, the, the, his experience and, and being around here was, was great for us. Great third, huh? What do you say? As it's Bacchus out there with Steele and Delorier to begin the game. Good luck, guys. Just high. A tribute inside Enterprise Center for longtime Blues fan favorite David Backus. 727 games as a Blue Note, seventh all time in scoring in franchise history with over 450 points. Gotta be incredibly emotional, I would think, for him. You know, playing that game, being acknowledged early in the game, and, um, you know, it was, it was. Heavy, it was beautiful, and uh, so grateful and blessed to have had that moment. I don't know what you got going on, but whatever it is, congratulations, big man. You deserve everything. Thanks, Kyle. It's been a pleasure to watch you. I appreciate it. And it's been, thanks for everything you've done for the game. Too, Thank man. you. You've been an ambassador of the game. You've been awesome for the game. So I really appreciate that. All the best. You're the man. It's been a pleasure playing with you. It's been fun. Thanks, buddy. Hey, take care of all of that. Appreciate you. But now Fowler gets it. He comes right in. Fowler waiting. Oh. Miko has lost his stick. And a shot, and they score! Yeah! Good job, Jonesy. Play Sammy. Great looks, man. And cut down by Pareko. The Blues give it away. Yeah. Oh. And a save ah. by Pennington on Jones. But we're going to a shootout based on a 2-2 a current score. 40% in his career. Trying to break the tie in the shootout. And a backhander, and he scores. Oh, sick. The reaction to the crowd, uh, you know, everything there was um, a testament to what he meant to that city. Thanks for everything, buddy. Hey, thanks, buddy. Unbelievable. Thank Good you. Man. For us to be able to go and, uh, you know, put him on the ice, play for him, play hard, um, was great for our group. Great for our young players, especially, I think, to see um, what kind of legacy uh, you can leave behind if you're, you know, do things the right way, play the right way. Uh, both on and off the ice, his family was loved there. Take care. Array's been just one of those guys that when you're playing professional sports, you could see that he cared about the people, not just the players, and that that means the world to you. And when you got 10 years with a guy like that that's continuously done that, um, that's a special relationship. and. You know, just to see him um, sticking around to give me a hug after that game, after emotions are already high. You know, him, David Perron, Jaden Schwartz, guys that I spent a ton of time with, and they sit at the end of that line, and it was, uh, you know, just all kind of welled up at once for me. Thanks, man. I was going to come out and soak you while you were doing your interview. <laughs> that would have been good. Stop me from crying like a baby. <laughs> That's great. You're the man. Glad that worked out. Appreciate it. Nice. Yeah, it was great. It was Perfect, I think, in my mind, um, you know, the best way to to end my career, uh, you know, maybe save hoisting a cup as the last game, but that's not always a realistic possibility. So, you know, a lot of thanks still going out to those people for, for all that extra work.